prime example of Frontier Developments, uh, well, whatever you want to fucking call it, uh, while playing, uh, well, about 15 minutes ago, uh, I got kicked off twice in as many minutes, and since then, whenever logging in, you get this. So, their servers are fucked up. This is no matter which version you, you try, um, and, you know, I'm trying uh, 1.3. Now, the last time I checked, I mean, I may be out of date, because I realised it was only about, like, you know, four months ago, but uh, I believe 1.3 isn't in beta anymore. And if you go to their site, service status OK. Is it out of date? No, because that's refreshed it. So this is saying that the game is working fine. They were saying that the servers are up. And yet, as you have just seen, if you try and log in and try and actually play the game, no, it fucking isn't. This is your typical uh, Frontier Developments... Uh, well, the typical Frontier Developments experience. I.e. a fucking joke. And uh, it doesn't stop there. I shall pause this while I look for a particular um, web page. Just one second. Right, so here we are on the uh, Elite Dangerous uh, forum. And this particular thread. The Golden Joystick Awards. We'd love your support. And the thread goes, well it begins, Some of the eagle-eyed amongst you will have already noticed, but Elite Dangerous and Frontier Developments have been shortlisted for no less than four Golden Joystick Awards. They are Best Audio, Best Moment, brackets, hyperspace, Studio of the Year, Best PC Game. Now let's take a particular look at those last two. Best PC Game. Right, the game was released unfinished. Um, we have had like all these constant uh, updates which are being advertised as updates, whereas in fact what they are is adding uh, features that were supposed to be there from the start. Uh, we have constant disconnections from the server, which means you cannot play the game, despite the fact that Frontier Developments, when cancelling the offline mode, said, oh, uh, you know, lack of offline mode will not affect uh, the gameplay in any way. Really? That's why I'm fucking doing this now, instead of playing the game, innit? Um... Then whenever a major update comes along, we get like, you know, at least two weeks of constant fucking disconnections with a game that is completely unplayable. Because you're lucky if you can stay connected for half a fucking hour before you get booted again. Along with that, every time there is an update, um, loads of old issues that were supposedly fixed reappear again. Whether it is... Uh, the text chat not working, that's always a favourite. Um, stuttering being fixed and then coming back. And that's how it just happened recently. Um, oh, fucking hell. Uh, things like um, appearing in uh, unidentified signal sources. Uh, when you get there, there is absolutely fuck all there. Um, there are... It just, it just, it's it's just so much that winds me up that I can't even think straight. So, you know, all of that, and yet we have them being nominated as best PC game of the year. Are they fucking taking the piss? And on top of that, studio of the year. So not only do we have Frontier Developments who release a game that is clearly unfinished, not only do we have, you know, updates that seem to break as much as they uh, introduce, not only do we have um, Frontier Developments having the fucking nerve to um, 
cool features that were supposed to be in the game right from the offset as oh new features that we have added for you not only do we have them adding features like power play that no one fucking wanted and has been a total disaster and now we've got the same with cqc which okay isn't as bad as power play but then few things could be not only do we have features that were promised that we are still waiting for i.e um, different fuel types i.e the ability to hire npc wingmen those two are never going to appear or the um oh fucking hell well that that will do for fucking starters so not only all of that but if you report an issue with uh, uh, the game in their uh, bug reporting thing, you are met with complete silence. If you criticise the game or point out, you know, problems with it on the forums, you are met with, well, from Frontier Development's total silence. You get endless bullshit from the fucking uh, brown nosers, but uh, from Frontier Development themselves, fuck all not only all of that but now this company who basically does absolutely fuck all when it comes to addressing issues that you raise with them about their own product now have the fucking unmitigated nerve to post this and say we want your help to get a fucking award that we in no way fucking deserve they can stick that right up their fucking ass.